Hi guys, welcome back to this channel. Remember, it's Max from the Max Creation. By the way, if you are new to this channel, consider sub subscribing and supporting this channel. Don't forget to click the notification bell for more videos. In today's video, we are going to talk about the latest developments that is circulating around. Remember, I always told you, I always keep on updating you wherever we get something that is new. By the way, don't forget to follow my TikTok account at Max Creation. TV, where I have the latest updates in Qatar, the latest updates in the Gulf countries for you to get informed. In today's video, I want us to look at um, what we call the new circulating information. Remember, this is all about the police clearance. Did you know that there is some requirement whereby if you need to change from the security job, to a new job, to another job, you need what you call a police clearance certificate. Yes, that is true. You will need what you call a police clearance certificate. For most of those people that have gone through the process that getting to change to those companies or that are aspiring or that have, to, have to already presented in their document to change to a new company, I think you've been requested to what we call a police clearance. And remember, for you to access a police clearance, it's not just a matter of fact that is not only it's not a matter of fact for you to go to police and uh, present your ID to get a police clearance for you to get a police clearance here in Qatar what you call the PCC you need to get a police clearance from your country of origin so you need to get that police clearance from your country of origin for you to have a police clearance certificate or to be cleared by police here in Qatar Remember, we came as migrant workers. We came as workers. We are not born here. So meaning that they need to first check the criminal record from your country of origin before they can ascertain or before they can give you a free criminal record report or a certificate in this country. And how does it work? It means that for people who are in security, you must be an alert. You must be on alert for people, especially people working for security companies. If you are going to plan to change to a new job from the security company, you should be alert. Because they will definitely, at one moment of time, they are going to require from you what you call a police clearance certificate. And for you to have a police clearance certificate, meaning that you need to have been cleared by your country of what you call a country of origin. So you need to get what you call a police clearing certificate from your country of origin. When you have it, it will be asserted. When asserted, that is when you present it to the Ministry of uh, Interior at the government offices. They will verify it, they will stamp it, and they will give you a police clearance here that is supposed to be used by the Qatar government. Remember, that is the latest development of I'm having. So I'm letting you know, you get prepared. Be prepared to have it. Be prepared such that that is another handbook of you to a paper to be by your pockets because when they need it and there's an opportunity for you to move on definitely it will be one opportunity that is going to deter you from moving to a new job that is going to come on your way hope i've tried to share up something for you so if you have the opportunity to have it have it keep it assertate it uh, stamped by the Minister of Foreign Affairs in your country, stamped by the Minister, stamped by the Embassy, a Embassy representing your country in Doha, then definitely keep it for any further, uh, any further development that will come. In case you need it, then definitely you'll have to present it without delay. Thank you so much for coming back to this channel. Remember, it's Max. I'll always keep on updating you. I'll thank you so much for the support, for the returning sub subscribers, for the new subscribers. Thank you so much. If you feel there's something that I need to talk about, if you think there's something that you need to know, that you are not sure of, that we can share, drop a comment in the comment section. I'll always be more than happy to get back to you. Thank you so much. See you again in the next video.